Thanks for checking out this episode of Brutal Battle Beer Break. Um, as I've done a few times before, I'm doing a beer by The Brewery out of Orange County, California, specifically Placentia, California. Uh, this is one of their 12 beers of Christmas, which they don't always release all of them, but this one happened this year, and it was Nine Ladies Dancing. That's uh, 11.3% alcohol by volume, and it is ale with cocoa nibs, vanilla, coffee, and lactose added. Sounds very good, correct? There you go. Nothing too fancy. If you've seen one brewery label, you've seen pretty much all of them. But they're classy. They're nice. I'm fine with that. So, let's pour this sucker. I'm excited about it. It sounds nice. So I'm assuming it's kind of going to be something like an old ale style. You know, when it says ale with all that stuff. All right, so it's, you know, uh, brown, uh, reddish brown. You probably can't really see that when I put it up there. It just looks dark, but trust me, it's like reddish brown. I can see around the edges. A um, little bit of a reddish head on top of it. Oh, you get a lot of the coffee right off the bat. Get that creamy nose uh, that you would get from the lactose. Not really getting the cocoa nibs in the nose. I do get that in vanilla, though. <sighs> a lot, a lot of coffee, though. It smells very nice. It smells very nice. I'll say that. This is the kind of beer, based on the smell, that I want to be having during the holidays. Yep. A lot of coffee on the flavor. Yep. A lot of coffee. It's got that kind of creamy mouthfeel from the lactose that's added to it. I can taste some of that vanilla. I'm still, I'm reaching for these cocoa nibs. The cocoa nibs are tough. I mean, maybe I'm getting just a tad bit, but that might be because I know what it is. Um, if you didn't tell me there were cocoa nibs in here, I might have a hard time with it. But I'm definitely getting the lactose. I'm getting the coffee like crazy, and it's a nice like roasted coffee. Um, and I'm definitely getting that vanilla aspect. There's also a little bit of like a sweetness on the end, which is probably coming from the high ABV. It's like a little bit raisiny, almost kind of prune actually as well. Hmm. It's a nice solid beer. I mean, basically it tastes like, you know, an old ale with some lactose coffee and, and vanilla added to it. There are cocoa nibs, but like I said, I, I can't pick them out at the, at the moment. Maybe as it warms up more, because it is still pretty cold. I just took it out of the fridge. So, At any rate, uh, good beer, solid beer. Not my favorite of the breweries, but a, but a good offering nonetheless. Um, so anyway, thank you everyone for checking this out. I'm going to keep it pretty short. And until next time, keep it brutal. <laughs>